Okay, we we've given you the benefit of the doubt, but you either need to leave or fuck off. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, do it. <laughs> fuck off. I will be. I will be going. Uh, I just. You know what? I'm going to explore this place. Fuck. Yes. Oh my god, That's this what is what this campaign is, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. So, Blavier, where would you head? I, what's okay. funny is we would obviously go the opposite direction. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> okay, this this room is not locked, so you could just open the door if you wanted to. Okay, I'll open the door. Okay. Uh, this is a meat locker. In here there are uh, six three-foot long chains, each ending in a hook. Flayed boar carcasses hang from four of the hooks, while the remaining two hooks are bare. Tasty. It's just a cold meat locker with some dead boars on it. Uh, I lick the meat and see oh. uh, what it is. Oh. Ew. Oh. My roll. Constitution eight? Sure. Save throw. Jesus Christ. Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh. Roll Not a constitution. Not a disadvantage for once. <laughs> yeah, you're you're really far away from Vinifex. You, 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 know. you lick it and shudder as it tastes gross because it's just a raw boar carcass that has been, like, skinned and not much else, I think. Yeah, so uh, so you lick a somewhat festering blood ritual dead pig. The, the pi As you step back away from the pig and, like, hold your hands to your head uh, with, with the, like, the strange sensation that comes over you, the pig looks up at you and says... Uh, Don't do that, Blavier. Uh, and goes back to hanging. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> the world does weird things around you. I don't like that. <laughs> so, I, we went here, right? Yeah, that that was the prison. Is down there. No, that's not okay. the prison. prison. Actually, so, interesting point. You're looping around this way. Let's cut back to the other group. <laughs> 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 so... The four of you watch, uh, uh, you know, Rhea with her longsword ready, Falister with his, like, dagger ready, as the thing heads north. So he heads south. Rhea's yeah. like, ah, uh, it, it, you know, I don't know what to make of that thing. Falister's like, it's evil. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's head south, see if we can find that shield or whatever. You've made your way back to the prison now. You head north. As you begin to head in this direction! <laughs> I can't see him. <laughs> oh, fair enough, okay. Not yet. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> oh god, not yet! Ah! <laughs> what? Uh, Falister calls out, what, what is it, strange man? I what do you see? Bad. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> it's here, no! <laughs> okay, what- Play what, anything? What do you want? What do you want? I'm not looking, I'm just exploring, like you said. I'm getting out of your hair, and you just happen to step right back up to me. Okay, so you keep going your way, we'll keep going our way. You're sure important? you don't want to be protected? I don't want to be protected by you, I am sure. That's sure? so funny that we literally met up at the fucking secret door. <laughs> I know, right? As you oh. open the door... This room is lit by a pair of tall wrought iron candlesticks in the northeast and southeast corners. Nine candles burn atop each one, casting flickering light across a claw-footed altar carved from a single block of obsidian, Ooh. and which has a small angel-shaped flame erupting from its top. Oh. A gray-haired wo gray woman kneels before the altar. Or at least, she was kneeling. Uh, as you open the secret door, she stands up, looks at you, and says, so you're the intruders that have been causing my son so much trouble. All right, combat, roll initiative. Well, I mean, she was, she, she took her turn to talk, right? She was giving a cool monologue. A monologue is a waste of your turn. Does he have a snake hand or is that a sock? He has a snake hand. The oh. snake hand can talk sometimes. Ah. Blavier, you're up first. The snake wizard just opened a secret door in the wall, and you can hear, like, an old woman inside? She sounds angry. Hmm. <clears throat> Maybe I should... X. Cometh her down. Um. <laughs> I love how well this is working out. I wasn't sure if this was going to be, like, weird to the point that uh. it was hard to interact with, or weird to the point of being brilliant. 
It's brilliant. <laughs> it's so uncomfortable, though. Uh, I, I, I remember why I didn't watch the show. <laughs> yeah, I went Wait, ahead and finished on. the Let clip, me... and it's very weird. Yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> Let's fly towards the lady. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, yeah. Xavier doesn't have wings. Does Blavier, like, just have wings, or...? Yeah, I, I, I decided... Okay. I, I kind of did that because... Just because the, that you know don't really have... Since he's already gross... Um, they just, like, sprout out of his back spontaneously. <laughs> yeah, I'm cool with that. <laughs> and, like, sure, it's, like, in, like, a wet slopping noise, like, <laughs> and there's just wings. <laughs> so, Flavor, you, you, it's a lot cooler when Yasha does this. Yes. You bring out your wing. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, you are free to fly up to 60 feet. So you fly past a zoo, which a zoo is a very disturbing experience, uh, into this small altar room, and you see the Duchess as she looks at you, Blavier, and her horror. eyes go wide, and she's like, Oh, no, you freed the, the thing! <laughs> oh god, kill it! Oh god, kill it! I'll give you money, just okay. kill it! <laughs> I've been, I, I've been practicing on a monologue for this. Oh my so, god, no. do it. <laughs> Okay, but I need to. Ah, uh, man, did I just forget? <laughs> what, what I... Take your time. I want to hear your monologue. <laughs> I don't. Seem a bit angry. What is the matter? And that's the monologue. Just... <laughs> <laughs> now let's we'll do this out. We, we can even say like in the narrative, everyone is too stunned to take their turn, so everyone just lets this happen. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> and the I'm Duchess like, just, that room with it. <laughs> the Duchess just kind of looks at you and is like, In the name of Serial, I would have you be gone, foul thing! You seemed a bit like a cultist, just from what I'm seeing. Maybe, does it have something to do with your insecurity? <laughs> Bro, you don't need to come for her life like that. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there was a problem at uh, at our art museum where you saw a beautiful lady on a painting and that you wanted to get rid of it because you didn't like that it was prettier than you. Oh. But just so you know, oh. just because you're ugly on the outside also <laughs> means you're ugly on the inside. Yeah. But, but you can change that and be a better person. Okay. Xavier's <laughs> coming for this bitch's life. Oh my god. Xavier, <laughs> roll performance with advantage so powerful it overrides the bad luck aura. Hey, how fucking dare you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's fair. It's not as powerful as Yogg. Just roll straight then. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. So here's what she does with a 13. I, I I was going to I was going to on like an 18 plus have her like legitimately completely break character and like ask you how. On a 13, she just screams. <laughs> she just screams this horrific blood curdling scream of terror that is enough to snap everyone back to reality and initiative resumes. Oh, there goes gravity. Oh, I wrote. <laughs> so here's the question: How how badly am I repulsed by Blamier? That's, that's up to you. That's really important. Um, I mean, I feel like the answer is a lot. Yeah. <laughs> and he just popped out like gross, wet, sloppy <laughs> wings, right? That he did. Ah, uh, that's fucking unfortunate. I'm gonna twin spell chaos bolt. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. You know what's even better? If they, if I roll double damage on both, it just goes to the other person. <laughs> oh god. And, uh, what, can I roll luck? Yes, yes you can. See what happens. I'm not gonna cause... let it happen, like, every time you get attacked, but because it's specifically, like, PvP, sure. <laughs> oh, that's fucking <gasps> It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <gasps> it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Roll a D18, you motherfucker! <laughs> I'm good at everything. Uh, uh, three. Uh, Arcana. Pog. Roll a D5. This is one where someone else gets to roll on the table. Uh, D5. Get a one, get a one, get a one. Yep. Get a one, get a one, get a one. Uh, four. Oh. It's Falister. Okay. Oh. He'll roll a D. 100? I hope he dies. Oh, okay. Falister gains Divine Shield. Dope. Pause. <laughs> Alright, uh, so I will mark That's that cool. with... I 
Uh, we'll, we'll let orange dots move on PCs be yog things waiting to happen. Um, and then an 85. Oh my god. Super fog? You know what? Here's how we're going to narrate this. Because we still <laughs> also need to do Blavier's Matt 20. Yeah. Blavier. You see as Vezax enters the room and he fires a ridiculous amount of magical <laughs> energy at the Duchess. Some of which reflects towards you. And you look at that magical energy and you look at you look at uh, Vezax and you kind of understand where he's coming from. You've, you've seen this kind of reaction from people a lot before. And you're like, no, fate wants me to be with this guy. I need to get him to like me. So oh, you no. look at Vezax. Oh no! And I'm so what I'm going to I'm going to tell you what happens, and you tell me what you might say along with this to make this happen, okay? okay? Because in addition to those two beams of energy missing you, for the next 24 hours, Vezax automatically succeeds on all luck checks. In the narrative, <gasps> this is not Yog. This is Blavier. What does he do to cause this? Like, you you are yeah. willing the Through... universe to give me advantage on all luck checks for the next uh, 24 No, hours. no, not advantage. Auto success. Oh. For 24 yes. hours? Yes. This is one of the best things on the table. It seems that fate has given you the power of luck. 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 What the fuck? <laughs> Vezax, you look down. There's a platinum piece on the ground. Kind of buried in a crack in the floor. I did pick it up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I imagine Vezex looks very uncomfortable and is like, like, touching his body and scratching in weird places because there's some, like, feeling that has overtaken him and he doesn't like it. So I'm going to roll insight to see uh, if she has changed by my, uh, by my speech. Okay. No, her eyes are filled with a murderous rage, and you suspect that you, with with a seventeen, this lady's made her choices. She's probably made some devilish contracts. There's not a lot you could do for her. Okay. Fine. If you cannot change your ways, I must use the dart of. I don't really have a name for this dart. It's just a dart. Um, and I... <laughs> and I... You, I take the... And I have the instrument. And oh, I... Oh, God. I, oh, no. As I blow the instrument, like, a dart comes out, and uh, I shoot her. Guys, how was he playing that before? I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Quadruple 17s. They're all 11s, too. I have updated my Discord status. Thank you, Seth, for that wonderful line. Um, as, yes, you hit her with the dart, and she takes eight damage. As it stabs her, like, in the forehead. Azu, you're up. Uh, Azu, he did something to me. <laughs> Azu! <laughs> when you leave, I'm gonna just shut the door. Oh, you're gonna shut the door and lock him in, leave him in there? Yeah, I'm just gonna ready. Wait, okay. Oh, no, he's gonna ready. Wait, can it be open on the me. other side? Oh, oh, you're, you're uh, readying on. an action to shut the door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like okay, okay, okay. Vezax, you're up. Uh, I'll just leave. <laughs> okay, and the door is shut. <laughs> I just look at everyone, I'm like, he did something to me. I don't feel okay. <laughs> uh, Falister's like, L -l -l let's just get out of here. Leave them, we're, we're out. Wait, and what if like, the shield's uh, in there? What if the shield's in there? Fuck. Oh. That's his turn. Believe your <laughs> <laughs> No, it's hard. She's two. You're right. Uh, she's gonna try to get out of the thing. This is and fail with a five. Believe your it's your turn. I will finish her by oh. doing the the dead dance. The so as you're hearing outside of the room, you hear Hey yo, hey yo. Uh -huh. <laughs> What was it doing to her? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Like, like, it's, it's, it must be turning her into one of it. I feel bad Another for her. Thing. I feel bad for her. Should we help her? What? Do I roll like again? Yeah, sure. 
<laughs> I mean, okay, so what is the dance of death supposed to do, play if you're just killer, or...? I think it should honestly be just vicious mockery. <laughs> So yeah, I was I I think believe your she D4 well, only a D four yeah it okay it deals one psychic damage to her she just starts crying <laughs> both as a combination of the psychic oh, no. damage and just pure just not even terror at this point something beyond that something the 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 utmost combination of terror and confusion. <laughs> Raya, what are we doing? Are we going in there? Or are we staying out here? I don't know. I. What would Torm do? What would Torm do? Torm would protect the weak and the innocent. I this thing there. is not innocent. No, but that woman is. She doesn't deserve this. <laughs> oh God! I'm coming! And she flings the door open, runs in, and just like stands, unable to move farther. That's her turn, Azu. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll put you out of your misery. <laughs> no. No. no! Oh no! Uh, I mean, you hit because her AC is crap, but she's still not <laughs> okay. Oh no! Look at his I'm sorry! I'm sorry. <laughs> um. <laughs> Make an end save and disappear. Oh no! Prolonged <laughs> <laughs> <Come on>, suffering. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, she fails. She's on two hit points. <laughs> oh my god. Ballister! <laughs> Ballister runs in and stabs her in the back. <laughs> oh my actual god. Where's his stat? Okay, he gets the, the killing the blow. Okay, good. And with her final breath, as her body goes limp in the claw, she just croaks out through her tears and snot coming down her face. See you all in hell! And she dies. No, you! Uh, initiative is over. Blavior, would you do No, it's not! <laughs> okay, I mean, if initiative's not over, Blavior, it's your turn. <laughs> okay. Well, I do the peace sign. And I try to teleport to an important uh, room that we haven't been in yet. Roll luck. <laughs> what? <laughs> Please succeed. That would be so. Hard. Yo! Oh my God! He rolled a twenty. That's insane. I, you know, I, I really am willing until, until like things settle down a bit. Are you guys okay with him just like succeeding so, for narrative purposes? Or yeah, I could just so, give him my twenty. <gasps> you want to do that? <laughs> I, I really don't. But like I also do. So it's completely here, meta. Let's do it thing. for the meta. Right, right. Here's my thing. I need there to be a reason that we don't just utterly reject and try and kill this thing. Um, and so I was really hoping that in this combat, it would he would provide some not horrific uh, injustice <laughs> onto me. Um, but that's all he's done so far. So I think for the purpose of trying to actually embed uh, Seth's character into our party and not have he needs to murdered, he needs to teleport out of this room. He right needs now. to teleport out of this room right now. Fair enough. So <laughs> through the power of divination wizard and everything you just said. Let me, I'm pretty sure I know which room the shield is in. Let me check the notes to make sure. We're just gonna find it. We're gonna find that room because we'll just hear screaming from down the hallway. <laughs> yep, so Blavier, we'll get to what's going on with you in a bit. You are here. Oh God, where'd he go? Blavier is gone. Initiative is over. Rhea is crying. Ballister drops his short sword and falls to his knee. <laughs> <laughs> guys, guys, he did something to me! I feel like someone's looking at me, but not in a good way. <laughs> fade, fade, fade. Ah! Ah! <laughs>